Hello everyone, my name is Arpita and I welcome you back to my channel Flights of Fantasy. In my last video, I spoke to you guys about the contents of my travel makeup kit. Today, I'm back with yet another informative video. I'm going to share the important documents that you're required to carry on the first day of your interview. So let's get started. First things first guys, get your hands on a professional folder or binder. Opt for a black or brown folder. Label your folder appropriately. Do not forget to carry a notebook and a pen. Then comes the most important content of your folder. That's your resume. Yes, a resume speaks a great deal about you as a professional. It says what you've done in the past, what you're doing currently and what exactly are you headed towards. Just imagine, a small piece of paper talks so much about you including your past, your present and your future. Doesn't that sound amazing? Yes, it does. But remember, the story of your past, present and future needs to be conveyed quickly. Otherwise, the recruiters will lose interest. Yes, so this job of telling a short story can be really tricky. Hence, you might need a little bit of assistance in drafting your resume by professionals. It is very much important to have a structured and concise resume to make the first impression work for you. Do not make your resume so fancy and full of jargons to make it cumbersome for a recruiter to read. Now, the next thing is you need to carry passport size photographs. I would recommend that you carry at least six of them. While getting a passport size photograph clicked, make sure you dressed in formals and a white background really works well. You also are required to carry a full length formal photo where the top of your head and your shoes are visible. Hands straight by the side with both legs together, sharp and in focus. Again, try keeping a white background. The size of the photograph should be four by six. Yes. Do carry copies of your photo IDs, copies of your passport, copies of your Aadhaar card and your PAN card must be a part of your folder. In case you do not have a passport and you have applied for the same, do not forget to carry the receipt which states the foresight. Now, we move to your educational qualification. Do not forget to carry copies of your highest educational qualification. If your highest educational qualification is your 10 plus 2 certificate, please carry the passing certificate of your 10 plus 2 or your graduation certificate or post-graduation certificate, whichever is your highest qualification. Then we move on to professional qualification. If you are a fresher, this will not be applicable for you. However, for candidates who has work experience in any vertical, I would request all of you to carry your experience certificate, copies of your appointment letters from your previous employer, relieving letters, salary slips, etc. etc. Candidates who has flying experience must carry their competency cards. That will be all that you need to carry on the first day of your interview. So what are you waiting for? Prepare and organize your files and gear up to your big day. If you have any questions, please do write to me. If you like this video, please do not forget to give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel Flights of Fantasy. I'll see you guys soon with yet another interesting video. Till then, stay happy and healthy. This is Arpita signing off from Flights of Fantasy.